All right, we here. Thank you, Minds Podcast. We appreciate everybody for tuning in, liking, subscribing, doing all that. I know we've been having trouble putting some content out, but the content is coming. Just bear with us. Uh, disclaimer, we're not here to hurt anybody, offend anybody, uh, no sex, race, anything like that. Uh, this is just to help people think. Uh, so just be calm with us. You know what I'm saying? We're not clapping back in the comments or none of that. You know what I'm saying? So make sure y'all tune in. This is sponsored by Holy Water All Natural Products, W-H-O-L-E-E water.com. Get you some sea moss and all that type of stuff. I am Max C. Max C, don't sleep. You know what I'm saying? One third of Thinking Minds podcast. Who else with us? Answer to the question to be or not to be. It's a boy meant to be. Body Pines. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So what's going on, man? What's going on? Uh, you want to hit the singing bowl real quick one time? Just one time, man. Let's get the frequency right real quick, man. Maxi, I haven't heard your favorite frequency in a while. I know. About this? <laughs> let's see if you lost. Let's see if you lost. Let's, oh. Let's make us all look back when it's starting, man. Y'all hear that? <sighs> what's wrong with this one? I know y'all can feel that too. You can feel that frequency through this, through this broadcast right now. It's picking up on the podcaster too. Yeah, it's sharp. Yeah, yeah. That's why he has to go last. Yeah, yeah. <sighs> California white say. You have to wait okay. and you have to listen for my frequency. Why do I feel tense? You get the uh, remote. Here we go. All right, you can go on past it now because uh, we might lower the frequency. Right there. <laughs> <laughs> I swear. <swear. laughs> Always come at mine. <laughs> come Let's on, me, Maxi. Let's get it, man. Let's get it, man. Let's get it, man. We got it about, uh, you know, uh, 132 hertz right there. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, so what's going on, man? It's crazy across the world right now. Uh, college campuses is going crazy, man. What y'all know about that? What's going on? I told you last week, biggest problem with America, mm. immigration. Mm. Immigrants. Mm. I said it last week. You and I kind of got into it. You yeah. think that... That the issue with America is that America is divided. Yeah, that division is being created by migrations. And whole thing is, it's not like migrations or like, no, it's not like the migrants coming here and they're doing that thing. No, they are coming here and they are purposefully serpentizing the people then that are living here. They are purposely, oh, y'all hate each other. We're going to do everything to make sure that y'all do like, like they are. They are now, even though black, even the blue, black and white are trying to get together here. Immigrants to me is the biggest number one issue in America. Nothing else. Yeah, it's a, it's a recipe for disaster. Whenever there's no like patriotism or camaraderie with you know the Americans that are here too, right? Yeah. I mean, so what's going on on the campuses? What's, what's that business? There's a big free Palestine movement, you know, going on on the campuses. Which is, I think it's, you know, whatever side you're on. It, but to me, like, I don't know why you would even pick a side. Like, we got enough, my personal opinion, we got to fix a lot of shit here. Is you know, before a war with Palestine? I thought Israel was a war with Hamas. Yeah. But what if... But that it, like, Hamas is, is based in Palestine, right? Yeah. It's like, the, Hamas is like the 
I guess the spokesman for. Hey, you already know how I feel about you know the war in Israel and everything. So I'm not like a, but I just feel as if like 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 the same way I come at like money being sent for for wars like slow slow it down. Don't try to invest so much in Israel war. Hey, do not mess with Iran. You know, do not try to defend. I do go against those things, right? The same thing with this. I see this, and they don't have a solution here either, right? All they are just doing is, one, like, there are some people that really do spend money to go to school, bro. Break it down what they're doing on campus. like They're fucking uh, protesting major, like. But in battle, what, what, all right, so what legacy, what, what, what legacy media is showing, let me put that in front of it because I haven't been on none of these campuses. I only know what the mainstream media is showing. So, like, Fox News and CNN are saying that the Jewish students are scared to go to class because they're being targeted by these protesters. Like, one, Palestinian one kid, one kid, yeah. one kid got his eye put out. I think that might have happened in Atlanta. They're but, like, what, what was that kid a Jewish kid? Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. And that's what they're saying. It's happening. Like I said, I don't know if it's happening. I could see it happening. Yeah, it's believable. Absolutely. Yeah. But, but but to me, and this is kind of me just going against the grain, um, what if this is a big, whole nother distraction built by America? Yeah. The biggest thing, too, that is like, to, to, it, it is. You know like what I'm way. saying? Like, like maybe... I don't Palestine think ain't behind but when this. you say built by America, we, what do you mean? Like, like we orchestrated this protest. But see, that, I think that's that's my problem is because we didn't orchestrate shit. Right. We are America, though. Yeah. We should be. You know what I mean? Like that's uh, the elites. Just say the the elites. That's who we got to. That's I'm, who we got to oust. Yeah. I need, I need people to start separating America from the federal government. Right. The federal government. Yeah. It's like the security goal for America, right? That represent America in the big war against yeah. everybody else. They are not America. They but, carry the wheels of America. They work for America. America paid the federal government. Each state pays well, the, the, the federal the government. The federal government takes. Yeah. Like, yeah, I'm, right. no, but it, I'm not saying that's not what it become. But the deal was we'll pay you and you will help us negotiate big on like uh, what we need here. Each state could not negotiate with each country like for what they need, like products wise. Like mm-hmm. every if Kentucky wanted to be a nation, Kentucky has to need food, fruit, everything. There is not enough people that know that can know negotiate all of these big things with every other nation out there. So what America came, the collective the state came together and said, okay, we'll form this union and we'll take this union to this place called the federal government. We'll put them in charge of negotiating for us what we need as states, what we need here. And we just gave them the money and then they will buy our product. And then at one point, okay, we need guns. They buy the guns, but they then take that money and they buy themselves bigger guns. Yeah, You understand, right? To me, it was like a security company, Right. That became so powerful that, like, the people then were sort of protect all the nations, or sort of protect. They're like, "Yeah, we are big enough to like take over you now, so you got to do what we say." We have the biggest nukes. The states don't have the nukes. That's what people don't understand. The federal government owns the nukes, but it's, it's not hard, owned by the states. But it's hard to be. At least that's we're what I'm represented. I might not be our than. government, president, whoever. That's who we're represented by. Yes. So it's hard to but we break us. Like that. But it's hard for us to break off. Even if we don't agree with the president or the government, they still represent us. Yes. So even if we're like, well, we don't agree with what's going on. That ain't American. Yes, it is if that's who's representing us, just like as black people Una, because or whatever. that person like, is on their side. That's what happened now. It happens that the President, like you're right, was the people representative to the federal government. Like, you know what? You are in charge, but the leader of you are going to be somebody that we chose. Yeah. So, so that was our president, right? So he goes and he has his cabinet member with him, right? But all of these people have been bought off by the federal guys. Right. Every single the president is now elected. Before he goes, they already chose him in our state. 
And they're like, you're going to be the next president, and when you can't come here, you're going to do exactly what we want you to do because we, that's how powerful the federal government have gotten to the point that like, the honest guy is even go, afraid to go be president. He's like, nobody there is my friend. Everybody there is for these guys. You understand, you right? That's how powerful they get, and you don't think they always been this way? No. Uh, never. One point? Are you kidding me? Be, 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 before the confederate Federation, all of this now. The Federal Reserve was in like 1915, no, 1914. It just started, bro. It just, but like but, the US, America, the people give the power. That's what they are talking about. Some people are talking about it's time to take it back. Because the truth is, they did. So I they watched gave this. Uh, the power to them. And if they're not doing what is right, the Constitution said you take it back. They literally said it in there. So I watched this. Have you ever seen. Um, how America was built. It's called How America Was Built, the Rockefeller story. And they show Rockefeller kind of run, run how he ran America. And then when presidency, presidential stuff started, he was like, place a president here. That way, when we fuck up, y'all can blame him. You know what I'm saying? Type shit. Yeah, so the like, same dude that said, Get, grant me access to a nation's wealth, and I care not who makes its laws. Right. He said that. And really? so, And so if you look at the, how... How we ran. Where what? He said what? He said, grant me access to a nation's treasury, and I care not who makes its laws. That is amazing. Right. And look, and just look <laughs> at it. Now, how is, how it, it's still, to me, it's still playing out the same way. It's just um, visualized. Like, we can put our own opinions on, because to me, there with the Palestine. Fear, though. But there used to be some fear, though. There but with the Palestine. But with the free Palestine college thing, um, uh, it seems similar to, and I ain't gonna say similar because I think it was it's a big difference. But like when schools is integrated with blacks, you know what I'm saying? Blacks was getting made fun of, getting whatever happening, this and this. And there but was the a, is right. The uproar happened before change. But happened. no, but Palestine. That, that's what I'm saying. The reason why your quiet question of do you think there's something like is this just a covered up and there's something more? That's what I'm saying. There is already go ahead or. You know, even going back to just the, the uh, you know, no disrespect or nothing like that to, to bring that the race and slavery thing up. But, like, black people are, are Africans or African-Americans uh, that was brought over here and just say needed school. Brought over here is what I said. Mm -hmm. So are Palestine people the same way? Did no. they, did they come that's here or saying. were they brought they, they, here? That's what, 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 what I'm saying now. The that's what, that's right. what the difference but is. Most of the protesters are white girls. That, yes. Like, you see and what, that's I'm, what saying? I'm saying? It's, it's uh, white people that are protesting, but they are acting like they said they are Palestinians. Right? Oh. Yes. You understand, right? Like, see, that's what's, they yeah. are acting like they said they are Palestinian, but they're right? These people will not be able to spend but, time in the actual culture of the land Palestine. So because are they the ones flying, the, burning the flags? Who's burning the flags? You can't it's, even... a, it's a hodgepodge. It's like, it, you know, the far left is what I would call it. The radical far left, you know, the Marxist people. Like when one start is just a like, So, you know, you, you we've heard them called Antifa, you know, in the past or whatever. I think that's what they go by. I think it's that group. That's doing like most of the protests. So what's the so solution? as well as probably probably immigrants too. So, like, so what's the solution of what's going on? If we really don't know the details, like why are they doing this? No, that that's the funny thing. There was an interview of two pro, pro protesters, and they asked them. There were two they didn't have a clue. Yeah, they, they were like, what, "Why are you doing that?" Yeah. They're like, "We honestly don't know. We just heard there's a protest, so we came. We came <laughs> here." And they come go to school and they're like, oh, and they're protesting. So, so is that joint? They're like, why are we protesting? Like, hey, we don't know. We're just doing so it. So somebody's so, stirring the pot. You understand, right? You protest is saying? a viral thing right now. Yeah. Yes. It's At just, any time. No school. It's an opportunity to not go to school. Like, people are just finding excuse not to go to school, not to go to work. No, just not to, to go, go to viral. And the people at the That's top. Saying, just to go viral. What, what this is doing is taking attention off of the it's an election issues. year yeah and not only that yes too, right wow, Biden's, yeah. Biden's let me tell you shitting himself do you know one thing i've been regretting a lot that people don't bring light on how much black people have started to speak up about y'all we are being neglected right here in our own face they want to talk about jewish people on tv they want to talk about palestine on tv they wanna, the communities of blacks that are coming together and saying we are going to vote Republican, right? Because they don't even care. 
They don't care that what is happening to us, that we are losing our homes, that the immigration is literally flooding our hoods, our what is belonging to nobody talking about that, right? They're not, and that's what I'm saying. That's the bigger picture right now. That's what I tried to tell you last week is for the first time, black people are like, we are Americans. We are fucking Americans. Yeah, I saw. And nobody's paying attention. I saw a black dude that, in Philadelphia you know what I'm saying, right? that was homeless. Like For the he, first time, they, I'm, they, they are claiming. Spot. They, they put immigrants in his spot. Do you understand? You know, they are like, claiming America. They are claiming no, no. But they don't want to talk who's about claiming? that. claiming? Black America. people in America are finally right. claiming America as their home. No, this our yeah. home. Yeah. Like, we aren't going anywhere. And there are all of these benefits. They are even speaking about why is so many money going out? When you're telling us we have no money, are you ready to tell telling us yeah. that you can't give us anything? But the news don't want to talk, talk, talk about this. The news don't talk about black people are frustrated. No. You know what they talk about? Is a bunch of white girls that I don't want to go to school. I'm that don't want to study. I, I, that, I, I, that I want see to go it now as a viral What's moment. your name? Yeah. What's your name? What's your name? As they scream and they stand there as the people that they call friends yeah. and everything get dragged away into jail. And what they do is scream on my viral camera so that I can, I can get one last picture of, and that's his name, y'all. And so just make, make sure that you go tap in and, and like and subscribe and and just know, free Palestine. Yeah. Because yeah. we could go and outside. that's what it is. Us three right now. And stop doing free pa pa no, Palestine. No, not Palestine. Just hold signs up with nothing on them. And say, oh, no, 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 and no. make a it's tweet. Done. It's three it's people done. on yeah. Dishman yeah. Lane. It's three we're, people outside protesting right now. But <laughs> oh, <laughs> shit. <laughs> if you just said, oh, shit, posted and spotted in Bowling Green. Oh, shit, there's three people outside of Slim Chickens protesting. <laughs> and they got signs to say nothing. I don't know what's going no, people on. People will start writing, writing, writing people in People will start thing, joining yeah. us. People will start yeah. writing, writing our own thing. On, it would on, get on, so on, like big. The whole they would have to shut down the whole area just because they would get so big yes. and people would bring signs with nothing on it. Yes, just to say like we're protesting. If we too. are standing in the middle of the high, high highway, just like lock hands with sign with no hands on, <laughs> people are literally just gonna join us because yeah. they'll feel guilty that there's just three of us. <laughs> they'll be like, there's gonna be more of them to make this effective, <laughs> sir. What are you protesting? Shut like, up. No, no, no. Shut up. We don't yeah, want to talk showed, about it. We don't want to talk about it. He just showed it aside. He said, you know, Noah, you are right. We don't want to talk Let's about it right now. Let's just stand here. Yeah. Yeah. And that's so, <laughs> the, and that's why And it, it would grow big. Listen, the first time, right, the first time I experienced a protest choice here was I was in Boston, Massachusetts, 2014. And I was working there, and the Black Lives Matter protest, the first time, just came about. 2014? No, like some somewhere late, like 2015, yeah, that's know. crazy because that's about 14. when the bomb went off in Massachusetts, wasn't it? Yes, when that it was, was that running. big Boston protest. Bomb. No, no, yeah. Boston bomb, yeah. no, that, that was went right off like 2013, uh, right after Trayvon Martin's trial, and all yeah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, that was yeah. uh, Trayvon Martin, BM yeah. just started to march, it did, it did, yes, it yeah, just started yeah, more, it more marching, and they made an and they made an announcement at the airport job that we had, which was a, a chef cooking. If you want to protest, we will pay you, and you can go protest. Yes, people that didn't speak. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, right. I see that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we'll pay you to go protest. So I was like, well, I don't want to pro protest, and I just want to work. Like I have to, like I got to work, and I'm like, yeah, we'll still pay you into work, or we'll pay you double mental if you work. I'm like, yeah, I would take a double. Like I'm you definitely going to. So people got mad at me. You black? Why are you not going to protest? I'm like, I'm African. Why am I gonna go pro 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 protest for? They say you get a day a pay. I say if, if I work, I get a day pay and a whole other day of pay. Why am I gonna go do when I go they pro 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 protest? Yeah, yeah, they yeah. wanna. Oh, you gotta go pro protest. You gotta show. I'm like, yeah. why are you gonna go pro protest? Because I get a day of pay. Yeah. But if you work, you get a day of pay and extra you fit pay. the description. Like, I don't know. You fit the description. <laughs> you the description. We're looking. It, hey. <laughs> In the description, it says two days yeah. of pay, yeah. but I need dreads. Yeah. We, do, we don't have many black guys out yeah. here. They're most yeah. fat white it chicks out here. It was nothing but Mexicans. Yeah. And I was like, they don't need black people. And we work with nothing but Mexicans, but I don't speak any yeah. English. Yeah. And you telling me the thing they're going to protest? They can't they're the sitting sign. at home, <laughs> freaking like, pretending like they're sitting at protest. But they told them, you have to like show you when protesting. So yeah, they went to the protest, took pictures of themselves, showed, and they came back and they're like, yeah, I went protesting. I went protesting. 
Like, yeah. and all day, they just come and walk in with a phone. And I'm like, but I got to pay and a half. People are mad at me, like, why didn't you go protest? Because I don't know any of these. So things. they didn't come back, like, all beat up and cut up and shit? No! Yeah. Nobody went to go so, pro, pro, so, protest. <laughs> you kidding me? They, they, they did their oh, own group pro protest outside of the, of the workplace. Okay, they so went outside and they stood there and they took paper and trust and then they went home. <laughs> so check this out. So 2024, uh, protesting has been around way past us. Um, I've seen when the last protest happened during like the Baltimore police killings and stuff like that was going on. Um, people start saying, we passed protest. Like, don't protest no more. It's about action. Do you think that that's where we at now? Like... We're past That's what protesting. I'm on Twitter. I think the protests that I've seen in the past couple of years, I think the wrong people get hurt. That's I why think I don't like pro- the, protest. the it's business not, owners. The the, like so, when they burnt all the cities and shit uh, a couple of years ago, it seemed like the the biz, the small business owners, they burnt yes. their own homes, are yes. the ones that got hurt. Like yeah, yeah, and, it's not, and that's another. That's for the elite, right? The they want to squeeze out small business here. owners anyway. Yeah. So I mean, think about it. Yeah. You know, like the real pro pro protest of what they are shooting for, the elites are not shoot, shooting for these protests. This is like like the spark, right? The real protests are people that sit home and our businesses are getting burned, and are on the phone with an insurance company and saying, But it was the protest. It was not me. I didn't do anything with it. And they're like, sir. The insurance policy says, and they're like, listen, I'm telling you the fire started because of this. And I like, sir, that's not what is on the insurance policy. The insurance policy said, these people are, they're anger, right? Right. When they step on the field, that's why you ask them. Are they ready to start stepping on the field, right? right. Those are different. Because yeah, there's that's not, a different yeah. protest. Because, because that would be pro- action protest of like, what seems if like these a kids, protest because, would have a demand. Let me show an example of this. I saw an example of this. A Tifa, the a t- 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 Tifa group saw like a a kid. I mean, saw a real picture, and they said a patriot group meet fake patriots or on paper pictures. And there are these kids there in the Atifa uniform, khaki pants, mask on, and there was a bunch of big older white men, and they're like, unmask oh, them, and they started grabbing them. Now these kids that were like walking around in like group like protesting like. And they're like, you are racist. You are not real American. You are unpatriot. Take that mask off. And they started ripping that mask off. And these kids, they couldn't do anything. These are now adults. Like saying, no, we are out here protesting for something real. And you are here making mess of what we're actually trying to fix. And they started to, now the second you see that, right? You see, like it got to the point that some of the adults are like, no, stop, stop, stop. We have to stop now. Because they were trying to like show them like, you are not doing anything out here. Y'all don't know what it's like to get violent if it's time to get violent. Y'all think that this is it. And that glimpse of it, right, tells me, yes, slowly, like, like I said, win or lose this election. Well, I'm seeing media mix it up, too. As I was strolling through my phone, I could see some saying protest, some saying strike. So there's a difference between those two, right? Well, yeah, a strike is usually with the workforce. Yeah. Like, so we're going to stop doing something for you if for, you know and if they you have demands yeah. and they have and the unions were masters at that like when the mob got control of the unions they could control any facet of the infrastructure in america with that and that, yeah. nah so we're gonna wrap that up man uh make sure y'all tune in and check out that the, the free palestine thing that's going on I don't know what and it's about let us know what's going on yeah if you right? know what's going on with that uh do they have a purpose, America's or is there a de- passionate, bro. if there's a demand well, reasons? If there's a demand, you know, maybe the demand could be met. You know, I don't know if they want some. Two thousand seven, the some, most passionate thing time. Americans would care about here. What Discovery Channel was showing side case from Africa, and they were asking me, "Is that true? Yeah. Is that true? Do we need to send money to Africa? Oh my gosh, we got to send more money to Africa." Yeah. To this day, there are still side cases in Africa. No, nobody still got food. Tell them what uh tell them what you got, you know. Y'all, y'all know what? If y'all like this and as we grow, if y'all like this, please go ahead and like and subscribe on this channel and follow us and share everything. Share everything. So Thank you, my podcast.